Hi there, I'm Joey from Celestial Fireglass, and today I'm going to show you how to convert one of our propane CSA burner kits to natural gas. Our CSA burner kits are very popular with the DIYers. Out of the box, they make building a propane fire table very easy. And since they're CSA certified, they can be used in areas with public access such as restaurants and Airbnb rentals. The CSA certification ensures that they're safe to operate when installed properly. For proper installation, I recommend that you have a qualified, licensed gas installer make all of your gas connections. If you have access to natural gas for your fire feature, our CSA burner kits can easily be converted to use natural gas. To use these burner kits with natural gas, you need one of our natural gas conversion kits. The Celestial Natural Gas Conversion Kit includes everything you need to convert our CSA burners from propane to natural gas. It includes a hose with a quick connect, a natural gas orifice, and a sleeve to cover the propane air mixer. When purchasing the natural gas conversion kit, be sure you select the right size. The orifice in this conversion kit is sized according to BTUs and will need to match the BTU rating of the CSA burner you're converting. The first thing you want to do is unpack your conversion kit and take note of each component. The conversion kit will include the hose assembly, a stainless steel sleeve, and an orifice. Then you want to remove the end of the flex hose attached to the bottom of your burner. This will be tight, so be sure to use two wrenches to avoid damaging anything. These are all standard threads, so lefty-loosey here. Next, you'll need to remove the coupling. Again, this will be tight, so you may have to put a little extra torque in the wrench. Now for the inside of the coupling, remove the propane orifice and replace it with the natural gas orifice. You'll notice that the new natural gas orifice is larger than the old propane orifice. This is because natural gas has a lower heating value than propane. For this reason, a larger volume of natural gas is required to produce the same flame height. Now slide the sleeve over the propane air mixer. Natural gas burns much cleaner than propane, so we don't need to add air to the gas mixture. The sleeve won't be tight, but this is normal. Now you can add the coupling with the orifice back and reattach the flex hose. Now for the final part, you want to disconnect the rubber propane hose and replace it with the new natural gas hose. This is a flared fitting, so pipe tape should not be used. The other end of the hose with the quick connect will then attach to your natural gas supply. The fittings have half inch NPT threads. These are tapered threads, so you want to use yellow Teflon gas tape for this connection. Once everything is hooked up, all gas connections should be tested for leaks using soapy water. When connected to natural gas, this burner requires a supply pressure between three and a half inch and seven inches water column. Your gas installer will know if they need to add a regulator to reduce your supply pressure. They're likely to have one in the truck. If not, we do have natural gas regulators available. I always recommend you have a qualified, licensed gas installer make all of your gas connections. The Celestial Technical Support Team is happy to answer your questions regarding the conversion of your CSA burner kit or any of our products. We can easily be reached by phone and online Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Time. I hope this video is helpful to understand what's involved in converting Celestial CSA burner kits from propane to natural gas. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us by phone or online. We're happy to help. And the quote Samuel Johnson, Celestial wisdom calms the mind.